Time is 818. Want to get back over to Drew Reeves as we continue to monitor uh, the coastline up and down both Washington and Oregon as we await the first waves from this new tsunami expected. Yeah, so we're taking a look out in Newport, and this is one of the areas in our viewing area that would be seeing the impacts uh, the soonest here, expected around 830 or so. That is an estimate, of course, but uh, that's what they're expecting. So maybe in about 12 minutes. Uh, it's 39 degrees right now. You can see right now things are calm, but this tsunami advisory is in effect for the entire west coast and that's all of Oregon until further noticed the expect uh, the possibility is for one to three foot waves they're asking people to again move off the beach and avoid harbors and marinas and I don't want people to think one to three foot waves that doesn't sound like very much you have to think a tsunami is more like a wall of water coming at you three feet coming at you is more than enough to sweep you off your feet easily. You would never be able to withstand that. So they do not want people on the beach or near those areas that could be affected by uh, that water. And they're asking people not to go out to the beach to try and watch for these waves either. Strong currents are also a possibility or more unusual currents that we don't typically see are, are possible during a tsunami. And again, here's a look at the timing of these. About 8.30 to 8.45 is when they're expected to impact areas along our viewing area along the coast. Now we're taking a look up at uh, the mountain 36 degrees out at Ski Bowl looking very nice. We have not seen any new snow in a little bit on the mountain or at least not yesterday or today but we've got the nice base there. If you are planning on heading up uh, today or tomorrow it's going to be a nice day for skiing maybe some softer snow for the day uh, tomorrow especially into the evening. Now today along the coast it is going to be a mainly sunny day pretty mild temperatures into those mid to upper 50s. Here in the valleys, we're going to be right around 50 degrees in Portland. We've got that fog that we're dealing with this morning. That should clear out as we get into the afternoon, though, and then we'll be mainly sunny for the rest of the day into the Columbia Gorge. Also dealing with the fog into the east end, but west side, uh, they've got that breeze going, keeping them more clear, 45 degrees, mostly sunny. That's also affected our eastern portion of the metro area where they have not been dealing with that fog thanks to that breeze coming out of the gorge. And then on Mount Hood, going to be mostly sunny and mild temperatures on the mountain into the 40s into eastern Oregon. Uh, got some clouds and fog north and sunnier into more central Oregon. All right, I'll have your 74 forecast and we'll continue to follow more on the tsunami advisory coming up here.